What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Dat Louisiana Life. What's up, y'all? What's up, everybody? We are hanging out at the houseboat today. The weather's not the best, so we figured it would be a great day for Tara to cook us an alligator sauce pecan. That's me. So we're just gonna hang out. I'm a help Tara. I'm just gonna be our helper. She's just gonna tell me what to do. I'll cut some vegetables or whatever she needs and uh, she's gonna be the chef for sure. <laughs> no pressure. <laughs> All right. And we're gonna do a whole lot of chilling today. So just gonna hang out on the porch. Do what we do. Maybe a little fishing. Maybe. Off the porch. We'll see. I'm probably not leaving the camp. <laughs> Let's get started. You ready? Go Tigers! <laughs> I love this land. God bless the USA. Keep going. <laughs> I did. I sang the whole thing. <laughs> you missed it. I was trying to sneak I didn't up. sing it in my Celine voice though. <laughs> <laughs> And he's chilling in the boat, in the rain. He's enjoying the coolness. I guarantee you, he probably thinks it feels great. It actually does feel good out here. It does. We're going to go start prepping for the sauce pecan in a little bit. Yeah, you got a lot of chopping to do. I got to cut some alligator meat. Bell vegetables. Peppers. Yeah, bell peppers, onions, celery. <laughs> what you Maybe gonna some do? jalapenos. Oh yeah, I cut the, I cut all of that up. I got you covered. I know you do. What's well, fun? And just for the record, Tarrant did not get a single bite yet. No, and I've been fishing for probably forty-five minutes now, something like that. Not a bite. No. But I'm hmm. gonna keep at it. This is what I do. I went ahead and painted our sign for the camp. I tried this orange color. I do have another color, but I kind of like this color. We're going to see how it looks on the camp once it dries. I think it looks pretty good. It, it does look good. That pops really good. <laughs> Andy looks like he's punished. <laughs> You're not punished, buddy. You can come out the boat. He don't want us to leave without him. I'm doing my part. What you got going on? I guess I'm gonna get all these vegetables cut up for you. So we got three onions, four bell peppers, two jalapenos, and three sticks of celery. And we can add more if Tara wants, so. <laughs> That's what we're going to start with. Have it ready. You're going to dice them up? I'm going I'm to cut them up however you want me to cut them. That's great. You know I have a problem with um, cutting onions. I know. That's why I don't mind doing this. I start crying instantly. <laughs> I don't you know probably why. can it, rub it on your eye. <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't do anything to me. I don't know why. That's good. All right. Let me get all these cut up and get on, with it. on to the next step, which is you're going to make a root. Right? Yeah. Okay. Nothing goes better with alligator sauce pecan than muscadine wine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's true, but it does taste good. That's some good stuff. <laughs> While I'm sitting here cutting up vegetables, this is what Drake's doing. Catching lizards. Huh? <laughs> Why don't you go catch something we can actually cook? Like a fish. You did great. Appreciate uh, that. You got it. I'm here at your service. Whatever you need, Tara. <laughs> I'm going to see what else I can come up with. <laughs> hmm? Oh, I got to cut that alligator meat. I'm going to get Drake to do that. Okay. Fixing to start my room. I just put some oil in the bottom of the pot. I'm going to heat it up and then I'm going to add some flour and just stir it until it turns brown.
I'm gonna cook this till it gets to whatever brown color uh, looks good to me. Then we're gonna add our vegetables in. Take it a step at a time. I'll be here. <laughs> whatever you need. You ready to help me cut up some alligator meat, Drake? Come on. That's that, that's that jaw meat that came off that alligator drink. That? Is the jaw meat? One side. That's one side of his jaw. Not, that's just one side. All of that right there. One side from the big one. I got, a, I got two more packs of the other side of his jaw. <laughs> I'm guessing that's about three pounds of meat, jaw meat. About three pounds, I guess, all together. Maybe a little bit more. It's gonna be good. Well, that's up to Tara if it's gonna be good. <gasps> it is up to you. I did my part. We... <laughs> it's gonna be good. I know. I hope. <laughs> it better be good. <laughs> well, we brought sandwich meat just in case. Yeah. Huh? Well, it's hard to mess up a basically a stew. Just in this case, it's sauce pecan. You're doing great. Try your piece. <laughs> Some alligator sushi? Ooh, that sounds good. <laughs> so we got all our alligator meat chopped up. And Drake's going to hit it with a little bit of Cajun seasoning. Go for it. That'd be good. There you go. How's that feel? Gross. Huh? That sounds <laughs> gross. <laughs> I sure hope your hands are clean. I just are you washing them. them right now with the alligator meat? <laughs> If you don't get the root right, nothing else will be right. That's why normally at home I make a big batch of roux and freeze it. Yeah. Because it takes so long. I'm adding some of these nice vegetables that you cut up to my roux. I'm not going to put all of them right now. Just some. Cook it down a little bit. Good, huh? Mm -mm. <laughs> it's the start of some goodness. We're going to see. <laughs> That's a big old can of rotella. Yeah, I might not use the whole can. I use about two thirds of it. I might add the rest later, but for right now, I'm gonna use two thirds of it. I'm gonna stir this up. Oh, fire roasted? Yep. Tomatoes? Yep. I used them before in a chili I had made, and they were really good, so. I think when it gets a little colder, we're gonna try to do a Nutra chili, right? That sounds good. I think I would like that. I do think I would like that. It shouldn't be hard to get Nutras. We've been seeing a lot of them. So. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Let me get the rest of the stuff. Yeah, and Tomato sauce. Tomato sauce. Yeah, I got the no salt just because everything else has salt in it, so. I'm also going to add a little bit of chicken broth. Mm -hmm.
Let this cook a little while. Can we add more stuff? I like how you've been measuring everything and just kind of <laughs> just throw it in. Huh? I would be so discombobulated if I had to measure. <laughs> I would feel like I didn't know what I was doing. I'm gonna add just a little bit of tomato paste for now. Maybe more later. <laughs> oh, that much. I'm gonna let this cook a little while, kind of like a medium fire, so that all these flavors can mix together. Come sa? Si? Wee wee? Wee. Wee wee? Si si? Oh my you got God. one. It's shad. That boy knows oh. his fish. Look at the size of that shad. Ooh, we got some bait. Good job, Drake. You thought that was mullet. I did. Get another one. That's our jug line bait. Yeah, it. Look at the size of that thing. Let's get over here. That's, that's very good jug line bait. I'm gonna put that in the pot, Terry. Oh, ooh, no. <laughs> That's a slab right there. <laughs> Look at that thing. That's like as long as my foot. Look. Drake wanted to see if I could do it. <laughs> Want, wanted to see if I still got some skills. They're a little far. They're a little too far. Oh, Dad. That was a big one. That was, that was really close. Get him. You think you got him? I don't know. I, I threw over him. Did you feel something? Oh, it's a mullet. You got a mullet? That boy knows his fish. Take it. <laughs> I was just trying to see if I remembered how to do it. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. See if you can catch us some more bait. No, I don't think I don't see any around. I was just trying to see if I remembered how to throw this. I only learned mm -hmm. like what, sure. two years ago. Yeah, make sure you flip your weights on there. There you go. I don't, I'm not casting to catch anything. Oh, that was terrible. That's what you call... A taco. Taco Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> you want to throw pancakes, not tacos, Tara. Yes. I am aware, Keith. Oh, Taco Tara. I know I taught you better than that. You did. And me. But it's been a long time since I've throwing a cast net, right? Oh. <laughs> oh, it was a little bit bigger of a taco. <laughs> it wanted to open. <laughs> I think you missed the mullet. <laughs> I, I'll, di I'll do a demo. I think you should do a demo on how you throw a cast net. On a small cast net. Like I said, the yes. big ones are a little bit different. Yes, that would be great. But these are, these are our bait nets. I always keep a small cast net in the boat for bait. There you go. Cypress uh, bowl. Cajun boys need to know how to cook, Drake. You're doing great. I know.
Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of sugar in here just to cut down on the acidity of the tomato paste. It's not really like to sweeten it or anything, but. I believe you. <laughs> you believe me? Yeah. And we're gonna put in our Cajun seasoning. I did season the gator a little bit already. Yep. But this has really no spices in it. Ready to stir it up for us? How long do you think this has been cooking for? About an hour? Probably. Maybe? Something like that? Start putting them? Yeah. Gonna start adding our gator meat. It smells good. Here we go, we need smell o vision again. <laughs> cool, that's gonna be a full pot, Tara. Yep. It's probably gonna cook down a little bit. All our alligator meat is in. We're gonna let it cook a while. Probably let it cook what? How long you think? I would think like a good hour maybe. Yeah. I, I would think probably about an hour. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna cook some rice and some corn to go with this. It's gonna be good. <laughs> We're counting on you. <laughs> we don't have anything else to eat, so. <laughs> oh, we just caught, you didn't see the fish we just caught? Mullet and shad. Everybody tells us mullet's supposed to be good, so maybe we can try that if this goes south. <laughs> <laughs> it's, not, it's not going south. We shall see. So I guess while we're waiting on our alligator sauce picone to cook down, we just wanted to give a big thank you to everyone out there because we just hit 100,000 followers and... That's a really big deal for a lot of people, especially for us. Especially for us. <laughs> I know, because we honestly never thought we would get to that point. But when we started this YouTube, it was just kind of like for friends and family. And uh, we never intended to be more... Anything other than that. Yeah. <laughs> friends and family. But uh, it kind of morphed into more, and we've been enjoying the ride. It's been an amazing ride for us. Yeah, now we have 100,000 friends. And family. <laughs> yeah. And uh, look, we really do appreciate all the feedback y'all give us. and All the great comments. Most of Not so great comments. Yeah. Well, we get a couple of negative comments every now and then, but it's to be expected. We're not perfect. I mean, Tara's close, but. Oh. <laughs> oh, look, you're just trying to get some brownie points for something. <laughs> so we're going to do a little, a little giveaway for kind of celebrate 100,000 followers. So what we're gonna do is everybody that comments on this video, we're gonna randomly select three comments and we're gonna give those people some of our merch. Uh, so whenever we pick those people, we're gonna go ahead and comment back to them and let them know what to do. Yes. So. Three people get free Dot Louisiana Life merchandise. That's what we're going to do. So make sure to comment. And thank y'all so much. We really, really appreciate y'all. Really. Yeah. Drake's like, yeah. <laughs> I'm here. Y'all get to watch Drake grow up. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Go ahead and talk a little bit so they can hear your voice. It's not the same. Hello. <laughs> it's me, Drake. <laughs> <laughs> thank y'all. We love y'all. Bye. I'm gonna go ahead and move the cooking inside. It's getting dark on us. Yeah, <laughs> the bugs might get us. Finish it up in here. I'm gonna cook some rice and corn too. It do a little taste test on the sauce. Is that it, a sauce picon? <laughs> it was delicious. 
Definitely got a little kick to it. A perfect kick to it. Drake's gonna test out the gator. Huh? <laughs> That's good, huh? That's good. Probably the best animal I tried. Really? Wow. A big lizard? <laughs> That's what a gator is. There are some good eating animals for sure. Good news. It's all done. Drake does not waste any time. <laughs> <laughs> we said it was done, a dude come running. Let's see if you pass the test. Go easy on me, it's my first alligator sauce we come. That's got a great kick to it. Yeah? I love the kick. I don't think it came out okay. I think it came out great. What? It was good. It was good. So rate it for me. He ate like four pieces of alligator meat while it was cooking, so I know he enjoyed it. Like I said, this is like the best animal I tried. So I would probably rate it more than a 10. What? Wow. You're rating it over a 10? <laughs> Dang. I did good. It is delicious. She did good. I'm not gonna lie. She made a great sauce pecan. Thank you. Thank you for cooking. Thank you. Drake helped. Hmm? I cut. I cut the gator. I stirred the pot. I even helped catch bait. <laughs> I did all of that. You caught some shad? Mm-hmm. Well, we're gonna go ahead and finish enjoying this fantastic meal Tara made for us. So. And we decide if we're gonna do anything tonight or not. Probably just gonna hang out. It's gonna be one of them chilled camp trips. We do have bait if you want to bake some jerk on this. We all ate. Kind of tired. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't even go in a boat. No, no boat this evening. Good thing is, we got a lot of leftovers to put in the freezer mm -hmm. for another day. Okay. We're going to call it a night. My crew can't hang. <laughs> Neither can I. I can't hang tonight either. We tired. Long day. So, see y'all in the morning. Nighty night. Good night. Good night. <laughs>
<laughs> Scrambled eggs and sausage. Yep. This was on the menu this morning. That's a good menu. <laughs> Eat some breakfast in the rain. Yep. It's a good day to just nap all day. <laughs> or read. Read? It's a great day to read. I'm the only one here that likes to read. Yeah. <laughs> yep. You just ruined her egg. I did not. <laughs> you know how many people like ketchup on their scrambled eggs? I know. I bet it's a lot. Thank you for breakfast. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Good breakfast in the rain. Yep. Toward the beat. All right, guys, I think we're gonna call it. We finally caught a break in the weather. We did have a great time, even though we didn't leave the camp. We just hung around, watched the rain. Tara cooked us an amazing meal. That sauce bacon was fantastic. What you thought about it? I loved it. Yeah. Good thing is we have some leftovers to eat. I'm a pretty lot. sure yeah, <laughs> we're gonna eat some of that tonight too. So. Mm -hmm. And we want to thank y'all again for being a part of what we do. We really, really do appreciate it. So thank y'all for coming along for the ride. So we'll check y'all next time. Later. Later. Peace out. Thank you.